got one. We got one on the tube. What's up guys? Welcome back to Chasing Biggins. I'm Brandy and thank you for hanging out with me today. We are doing a fun unboxing video today with Bass Finder Box and uh, hopefully using those baits to catch some fish today. So uh, stay tuned. Alright guys, let's get started. This is Bass Finder Box. The cool thing that kind of brought me about this box was it has a barcode scanner on the side and it gets you to a place where you can see all your baits that are in the box, how to fish them, YouTube videos about them. It's pretty cool. So let's do this. Good little amount we got in here. First off, we have the list and prices of everything inside. Looks like we have 10 bait slash lures in this box, which, whew, that's very nice. There's that scanner barcode that's also in the box. Some good ones in here, guys. All right, looks like we have a Sabra or Sabre Toad. It's from Catch. Alright, this one is pretty small. I kind of like the finesse look of it. It's a lot smaller than my usual ones that I throw. We got some nice sharp hooks on here. And I really like that green back and white belly. Super soft frog. Alright, next up, another top water. I mean, as a summer box, you gotta have some top water baits. We got the Mach K Popper 70. It kind of has like a, a bone design on the side. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Nice little rattle to it. Pretty sharp little hooks here. And I always like that little feather. Just gives it a little bit more um, pizzazz in the water. Next up is a oh wow they got excited with the top waters in this one box this is a hyper elastic dart prop so it looks like a top water soft plastic with like a prop propeller at the end to kind of give off some vibration in the water oh yeah look at that it's like that black and i love this gold flake with this propeller kind of at the end very cool. A lot of prop baits have that, but I love that this is like a soft plastic and nice sharp hook. So literally this is pretty weedless. You could run this in like lily pads or right on top of like some thick grass. Oof, that is nice. Looks like we got some spear point hooks. These are six pack of three aught. I really like that. Really cool design from this company. Oh my gosh, okay, I thought we were done with the top water, but we have this one other bait. It's called a battle beetle from Lunker Hunt. Very cool. I think that this one can go subsurface too. Okay, very cool. So it says on the box that it can dive down to one and a half feet-ish. So kind of a subsurface bait. Look at that jointed body. Oh, that is cool. We've got nice sharp treble hooks at the end with the feathers again. That black body is just such a cool color. All right, we are down to the soft plastics in the box and I am a big fan of soft plastics. I'm just a sucker for them. So first off, we have Missile Baits Baby D-Bomb. So this looks like a really sweet punch bait. It is a black red flake. So look at that. Look at those ridges right there. Very cool. I like that it's nice and small and compact. Um, you can still throw that on like a three aught flipping hook and probably get a lot of great bites. All right, next up is a alien creature bait 
from H.R. Bates. Very cool. I haven't heard about this company before. Um, it looks like there is a six of them in there. They're about four inches long. At first glance, the shape kind of looks like a um, kind of a baby brush hog look-alike. A lot of appendages. like a baby brush hog to me has those big appendages and then kind of that wispy tail at the end I'll pull those apart very cool looking bait um, you could probably slow roll this in sometimes I even flip these kind of baits just because they look different from kind of baits that fish have seen before next up is Exxon Lures Blitz Worm. This is an 11 inch worm. And the best thing about this worm is the back of it floats. Yes, floats. So you could rig this puppy on a Texas rig. You could rig it on even a shaky head and just kind of slow drag it. And that tail is just going to float around in the back. It's going to look so sweet. And that's that June bug color, which I am a sucker for June bug in the summertime. Two more baits in the box, both from Net Bait Company. I've, I have never heard of Net Bait, but I like their packaging. The yellow and black, black and yellow, black and yellow. But uh, this is a four inch tube. They call it 10 point. I think that's the color. Really long kind of appendages. And the great thing about tubes is you can always kind of cut them down to what you want. If you feel like those bass aren't eating the entire thing, just kind of pluck in. Just shorten those little legs up and you're gonna get them every time. All right, last off is, ooh, okay, is the Dacker from Netbait. It's a four and a half inch creature bait and the color is Delta Craw. I really love this color. Uh, it has like a green pumpkin with like a really bright red on the back. I actually have a jig in this color. I think it would pair well, you know. You could also just uh, rig this Texas style and just flip it into cover. Really cool looking bait. All right, guys, that's the box. Um, if you're interested, I got a link below. And now it is time to try those baits out and see if we can catch some fish. So uh, stay tuned. First up, I have that catch popper. This little guy, very cute. Really like that black color. be trying that chatterbait with a net bait dagger that's what we put this one on see if we can get some of these fish that are kind of hanging out by these weeds and a little bit of a breeze over here which is nice I got one I got one on the tube Stay down a little bit. Oh, there's another one just right by it. Oh, no. Come here. Come here. I'm gonna go into the tree. That's not good. Come here. I think we got them pretty good. Woo. Come here. Yes! There we go, guys. Chill, dude. Mm. Oh, yeah. That's a good smolly, guys. Very cool. Huh. Just under two pounds. Beautiful fish. Just 
just under two pounds. All right, buddy. Bye. Oh, I had a bite. So happy with that tube with us. Um, saw this nice little shaded spot, kind of right where it drops off, and sure enough, there was a nice smallie over there. There's like a bigger one that was chasing it. Oh, that feels like a nice one, too. He's gonna push us right into that. Okay, okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. He's gonna, yep, just take us with you. Here we go. That's a good one, too, guys. You fight nice. Okay, 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 buddy. Oh, this is a nice one. Oh, come on. Come on, buddy. Oh, yeah. Hey there. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I cannot tell you the last time I've had fun with some smallies. Yes! <laughs> Holy cow, guys. Oh my gosh, you ate that bait. Look at that guy, he's down the gullet. Holy cow. All right. That's a nice one too, guys. Holy cow, holy smokes. Straight up two pounds. All right, okay, 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 okay. I know, I know, I know. All right. I'll let you go, okay? Bye, buddy. Holy smokes, yes. All right, guys. That was a lot of fun trying out those baits. Um, ended up being the tube for the win. Got us those two smallies. Really exciting. Ah, I just love fishing. All right, guys. See you next time.